My name is Eason Zhang. I'm nine years old, and I'm going to be talking about water pollution. According to Melissa Denchak of the NRDC, unsafe water kills more people each year than war and all other forms of violence combined. One million animals die from water pollution each year, according to Angels for Animals. If you don't hurry up and stop polluting the water, there will soon be very little people left on our planet. If we don't listen, our lives will be gone and we'll have to drink and shower using dirty water. Do you really want to live like that? Water pollution occurs when harmful substances contaminate any body of water, degrading water quality, rendering it toxic to humans and the environment. Study Move says water pollution is not a new phenomenon. Archaeologists find piles of stone tools and litter dating back 10 to 40,000 years. EPA says unsafe levels of contaminants in water can cause health effects. Chemical exposure through drinking water can lead to a variety of short and long-term health effects like cholera, tuberculosis, jaundice, and many more. NIH says risks with oil exploration are bad for the ocean with examples like the Niger Delta destruction as a result of long-term leakages, the explosion of BP's Deepwater Horizon Rig in April 2010, followed by the spill in the Mexican Gulf, which was officially the largest oil disaster ever. Replace petrol with sustainable clean energy sources like hydro, solar, and wind power because we will be using natural energy and not artificial energy. Turn off anything that uses electricity when not using it and buy equipment that uses less electricity or see if the device you're using has a setting that lets you use less electricity. Like nowadays, computers have a setting that lets you use less electricity called sleep mode. Pick up litter and throw it away in a garbage can. And do simple actions like picking up litter and blowing or sweeping fertilizer back onto grass if it gets onto paved areas, and many more. These solutions will work in the future because we will be using natural energy and not artificial energy. Even if the solution isn't using natural energy, we will still be using net less energy, which will cut our net CO2 emissions. Now, you may be wondering this about all of my solutions. We have been doing all of this, but water pollution is still an issue. Well, the answer to that is because not all of us are doing enough, so water pollution will still continue to grow. As you might know, it is easier to cause but harder to fix. We must do our part to prevent or limit water pollution, so in the future there will be less polluted water for drinking and showers that include contaminants, bacteria, and viruses causing long or short-term problems. Thank you for listening. Thank <laughs> you.